Hey, what's up? Kyle here again. Welcome to another DVD Blu ray tape video where I show the DVDs and Blu rays I got over the past couple weeks and months and months and months and months and months. I'm so sorry for long delay, for long delay, guys. I know I say it's set up in every DVD and Blu ray tape video, but I'm so sorry I haven't made another D DVD and Blu-ray tape video in a long, long, long time. Um, i just been so busy with uh, with work, and I just got back from a movie shoot uh, in uh, Wellsboro, Pennsylvania. I, I just did, I was acting in another movie. Um, I have a really fun, I can't say the name of the movie yet, but there'll be a vlog coming, coming soon when the movie comes out. I can't put it up yet, but when the movie comes out, it's a really c cool movie. Um, but I have a really fun role in it, and that's all I'm going to say, and, and it's going to be really fun. I can't wait for you guys to see this movie, um, but uh, it's, I just got back from, from a movie shoot, so I've been very busy with work and everything, but, um, you know, I, I have other things in the works coming soon, other projects, and um, I got a bunch, so uh, without further ado, I have, other, I have a lot of movies and things uh, to, to review in this update, it's been a while, and I um, hope you guys are doing well. And um, I have so, so anyways, I have a lot of DVD and Blu-ray update videos, some new titles, some old titles. Um, not many Blu-rays in this update, but a lot of DVDs, some Blu-rays. But uh, without further ado, let's get the DVD and Blu-ray update started. First one I got is from um, director Mark Polonia, and that is uh. The, from the Poloni Bros from Wild Eye Releasing, and that is um, Shark, Shark Encounters of the Third Kind. And this is a pretty pretty recent one. It came out from 2020, and that and it's um, so this I saw this movie. I really enjoyed I really enjoyed this movie. This is a really fun movie. Um, I really I, I highly recommend you check this one out. I really enjoyed this one. Um, it's about, it's about, um, I, I can't remember too much about it, but I remember this is like, has these alien, these green aliens in it, and, um, it's like, it's about like these, like, al these aliens and like the shark, these sharks and things that are coming to like, um, invade Earth and stuff, and, um, I, I can't remember too much about it, but I just remember really enjoying this one, and I always love the, I always love, um, my, the Polonia Brother films. I always like Mark Polonia's films. My good friend Mark Polonia. Um, I always like his films. He does. He makes great films. And the star is uh, Titus Hamburger, Hemmelberger, ha ha Natalie Hemmelberger, Jeannie Russo, Steve Despera, Jeff Kirkendall, Katie, Kate, Catherine Sue Young, Todd Carpenter, Tim Hatch, Chris Beacon. And uh, a few other people. Um, it's really cool. It has some really cool effects. Here's the DVD insert there. Really cool movie. It has some really cool features on it. Commentary by directed by, by by director Mark Polonia. Behind the scenes interview and it, image gallery scene scene selection trailers. Definitely check this one out if you're a Polonia brother fan. I highly recommend you check this one out. I can't get into too much detail into it because I don't remember too much about it. But definitely check this one out. It's a really fun shark movie. Um, definitely check this one out. Next one I got is um, from a uh, director. Um, his name is uh, Joe D. Winecoop. Um, this is a... Uh, an independent, a uh, low, a low, uh, an independent film, and it stars Sean C. Phillips, Joe D. Winecoop, Phil Her Herman, Debbie Rashawn, Lloyd Kaufman. This is part, and and uh, has a, a lot of people, a lot big cast, has a lot of people in this movie, and this is you can get this from his site. I'll put a link from eat this video from his uh, where you can get it from. And this is part one. Part two is coming out, and it's called the Craig Craigalon List Incident. Um, this is a really fun, like, you know, like, it kind of reminds me of, like, a shot on video type of movie. Um, like, kind of like, a like, shot on video, um, like, really fun, cheesy kind of movie. Um, I really enjoyed it. It was funny. It was cool. Hip and everything. I really enjoyed this one. Definitely check this one out if you, if, if you like, uh... Alien, like you know, comical, like you know, low budget movie. If you like really cheesy movies, definitely check this one out if you haven't seen this one yet. And definitely check, get, de, and de, I'll let you know when part two comes out. 
Next one I got is from uh, Joe F Fasano's, the, the director John jo John F F Fasano's, the, and James Hung is in this, and Marilyn jo John John Coda Coda, and this is the this is an old uh, like uh, horror film, like an old I don't know if it's shot I don't remember if it was shot on video, but it's from Bayview Entertainment. It's an old company that's not around anymore, but it's the Jitters. Really cool art, really cool cover. Um, I thought this was going to be a good movie, but because I, I heard, like, because I saw the monster creature effects in this, but it's not. It's not a good movie. It's really more silly. I thought it was going to have some gore in it, but it really wasn't my taste. I really didn't enjoy this, but it. I, I James Hong, Wong Hung is in it. I, I like James Hong, but this just was not a good movie. Kind of remind me of like, I don't know. It was weird. Just a weird, 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 weird movie. Um. I mean, if you like weird sh shit and like weird, like, I don't know. I can't describe it. It was just like bizarre. Like it wasn't like. It was. It wasn't. It wasn't like scary. It wasn't like gory. It wasn't like. It just. I don't know. It's a vampire movie. It's, it takes place in Japan, and it's like. I don't remember really too much about it, but I just didn't like it for some reason. Next one I got is from is is from a platinum. This is an old company, Platinum Disc Compo. Comp potion and this is a uh, you can get this you can get this also on uh, on um, region B uh, it's called ragman uh, trigger treat ragman I think trigger treat but this one's called trigger treat this is the original title trigger treat um, which stars Gene Simmons Ozzy Osbourne and it has um, Mark Price in it um, it's, it's called Trick or Treat. This is a really fun movie, an old 80s um, horror film with cool effects, cool like you know, really. It's just a really fun, like you know, like you know, like 80s rock and roll metal movie. A really cool movie. I can't. Um, it's about this this guy. I think gets like this new record, and then he puts it in his in his player, and then it brings back like one of his favorite singers to life. And it causes all this havoc and stuff. It's really fun. Definitely check this out. I love, love this movie. It has Ozzy Osbourne has a cameo. Gene Simmons is in it. It's just really great. And it's, it's hard to find, really. It's a really rare, uh, this is a really rare edition. Um, but uh, it's just really cool. I really enjoyed this one. It's not my favorite thing I've seen. I thought I was going to like, it's just, it's just really good, though. Definitely check this out. Next one I got, and the music in that is really cool too. Next one I got is from Wild Eye Releasing, and this is by director D Dustin Ferguson, and it stars Mel H Novak, Don Don Lee Hensing, D Briggs Stevens, and Sean C. Phillips, and some other people. And that is Apex Predators. This is this was in Walmart. Actually, this is in Walmart actually. It's a new, it's a new shark movie. It's a new shark movie. And, um, to be honest, I didn't care for this one too much. Um, it was just so... I usually like Dustin Ferguson's movies, but, I mean, his movies are just okay. I'm not a big fan of his movies, but some of his movies are good. But, you know, they're hit or miss with him. But, um, I, li I watched it because Sean C. Phillips is in it, but, um, I, I like his movies, but, you know, I just... This movie was dragged on too much. There's a lot of scenes where there's like long shots of like, you know, where where like got like just like shots that are not necessary in the movie. Like I don't know, it just wasn't like there was not many sharks in it, and then the ending was just so it ended so abruptly. I don't know what this, uh, I don't know what this was. I didn't care for this too much. Don't check this out. Next one I got is this one I really uh, this one I highly recommend you checked out. This is from the eighties. This is from nineteen. This is from the Warner Archive collection, and this is a an eighties movie. I forget nineteen eighty six. It's called 
um, Killer Party, directed, and this is di actually directed by one of the direct, uh, the guy who directed, uh, the, um, Welcome to Goosebumps, Welcome to, uh, a couple of Goosebumps episodes, Welcome to Dead House, um, I forget what other episodes he directed, but he directed one of my favorite episodes, Welcome to the Dead House. He directed a lot of Goosebumps episodes, and he directed this, which is, directed this movie before before Goosebumps. Um, William Frat, Frat, at William Frat, and this is a really, really, really cool movie. I highly recommend you check this one out. It's called Killer Party. Uh, it's it's a, this is I think this is the only edition you can get of it. It's a it's a, it's like a burn on demand kind of. Burn, not burn on demand. Uh, Art Mortar Archive, like you know, just like a regular D DVD R kind of kind of DVD has no special features on it. But it's, a, it's it's I would love to see special features of this movie. This is a really creepy, eerie movie. Really cool. Kind of reminds me of Evil Dead, and like um, kind of like has like an Evil Dead vibe, and like uh, what's that movie? It's just that it's about possession and stuff, and like it's just a really cool movie. It's about these people. It's about these. I forget what. It's like this. It's like this. Like you know, it's com. It's a comedy horror, and these. And it's about these girls that want to get into this fraternity, like, and um. I forget really much. Too. I don't remember too much about it. What it was about, but um, like. I, I'm sorry if I'm lacking on the on the reviews today. It's just been so long since I've seen these movies. It's been a while. Um, but, uh, let's see what it says. It's April Fool's and the sisters are Sigma. Oh, it's, yeah, it takes place on April Fool's Day. April Fool's Day. And then they, like, they pull pranks on people. Like, the kids pull pranks and stuff. And, um... And one of them gets possessed or something, and then I, that's what that's what I remember. But it's just it's just a really fun, cool, creepy, fun movie. If you like, you know, like creepy, eerie, cool like movies, like in like like you know like possession and like you know um if you like fun, it's a slasher too. It's it's like a possession slasher movie, like you know, like a demon slasher movie, a, a fun demon slasher movie with like kill, like you know, like you know, it's just really fun. The the kill scenes are cool in this. It's just really fun. Definitely check this out if you haven't seen this yet. It's a really cool movie. It's hard to find. It's a really rare one to come around, but it's really cool. Next one I got is from SRS Cinema, and that is a, a, another film directed by my buddy Mark Polonia, and that is uh, Virus Shark. And this is another really cool one that I highly recommend you check this one out. And it's um it's it's about the it's this is another cool one. It's about this the, these uh, group of scientists like you know technicians in this that are working in this lab, and then the, there's this like shark that spreads a virus to these to to the te to the to the scientists spreads a virus and people are starting to turn into the as uh, people are starting to get like you know infected by and they're trying to find the antidote and p and they try to find out what these things are and it's uh like these like is if it's aliens or sharks or something and it's just really fun and it's like it just real it's a re it has really cool effects and, and like you know really cool monster makeup and like sh and and stuff really really cool movie Definitely check this out, and if and uh, definitely check out Mark Polonia's stuff, and check out Mark Polonia's movies. Really great friend of mine. Um, definitely check this out if you haven't seen it yet. Um, this is it's directed by it's put out by SRS Cinema, Ron Bonk. Um, this is a really cool one. Um, a lot of his I love the Polonia brother movies, and and this is a. And definitely check this one out if you haven't seen it yet. And check out also check out Shark Encounters from the Third and Kind. And just definitely check this one out if you haven't seen seen this yet. Definitely check this out. Next one I got is from um, Sob Horror. That is uh, Natasha Knightley's Bordero of Blood. This is another really cool. Um, this is a, this is a pretty interesting uh, shot and video type of movie. It's like a kind of like commer has about has commercials and it has um, like short films and it like kind of like 
kind of reminds me of like a trauma, trauma dance, kind of like kind of like into a movie. Like an, it's an anthology film, and it's um, it's hard to describe. It's very different, but it has like sh short films and like and and it has like com like fake com like funny commercials and stuff. It's all shot on video. Um, this is from SLB Horror, Tony M Mussolini, Mas 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 Masello. Um Really cool movie. I definitely check this out. And I'll put a link underneath this video where you can get it. Um, definitely check this one out if you haven't seen this yet. Next one I got is um it's actually on VHS and this is from my friend um Horror DVD Devil three 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 and this is um he sent me this actually a while ago and I just and I and I I've been watched I I recently watched I watched this a while ago I never got to review it but um it's a VHS tape actually it's 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 a uh, and I did an unboxing video of this it's uh the Horror DVD Devil DVD Devils short films and this cool little pa uh sh like cover art that he drew hand drew and here's the tape inside um it's this is a really cool fun heart uh, a couple of, these are really fun horror shorts in here that um my friend tim Gr tim gray horror dvd devil 3333 um he direct uh, he put a, a couple horror shorts in here that he did our uh, Sean video, um, and a couple animations in here, really fun stuff. And you can get ask and he's making and these are like handmade covers with the bloody hand and the and like all different cover different cover arts that you can get from him. Um, it's just really cool, like you know. And he's a good friend of mine. Definitely check out. T t Horror DVD 3333. Uh, I'll put a link underneath this video for his YouTube channel. Um, and, you can ch and you can ask him for a copy of these. And I and I'm actually I have a cameo in his new uh, upcoming Sh Sean video horror film. Um, I forget what it's called, but I can't say the title yet. But uh, the film is coming out soon. But I have a small little cameo in that that's coming out. Um, but this is really cool. If you like Sean video, short films, and like like little animation stuff, and like just like a compilation of like home video, like like little sh like independent art, independent art, definitely check this out. Really cool stuff. Definitely check this out and support my friend Tim Gray. How are you, Devil Three Three Three? Next one I got is is a now on to now back to DVDs. Next one I got is a uh, zombie eight. I, I'm I'm Bur I'm I'm Baron DK. This is um this is from a uh, retro exploitation, but directed by Dustin Ferguson. Um. This one was okay. I didn't really remember too much of it, but it was just it was it was all right. But it wasn't my favorite Dustin Ferguson movie. But I I, I liked it for what it was. It stars Mel Novak, No Noel, Jason Scott, Julian Prescott, and Chauncey Phillips. Is I think this is this kind of looks like a rip off of a zombie, like but it's a uh, it's a fun movie, um, but it's not the best thing I've seen. I can't remember too much about it, but I remember enjoying. I remember it was it was pretty decent. Next one I got is um, this is a classic, of course, and I got this for my girlfriend Lisa X X Mento Star X X um, for, for uh, I forget what it, what it was. I got this a while ago, but this is a she got it for me a while ago. But this is a classic. This is a Prom and Child One and Two. And uh, this is the the, the, the two pack. With part, the fir first two are the best. These are the first two. I personally like them both equally. Uh, with John Ritter, John Ritter. These are funny, funny, funny movies. Definitely check these out if you haven't seen these. Um, but this this guy, this is this family adopts a kid, 
a little a kid from this orphanage, and he gives and he starts it's all this like these little pro these he he creates problems like you know in the house, and he creates like all this havoc and like all this like like the little like you know like he's like a a, 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 a like a, a like a, a menace like kind of like don't it's kind of, he reminds me of a it kind of reminds me of like 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 a Dennis the Menace kind of like um really you you all seen the don't, the Problem Child movies these are classics these are funny my favorite these are like my favorite com like two two of my favorite comedies definitely check these out the third one the third one was all right though I actually thought it was all right. Actually, a lot of people didn't like the third one, but I thought it was, eh, not as good as the first two, though. But definitely get this. It's great. And next one I got is from Synapse Films, and that is Rock and Roll Nightmare. And this one I absolutely love. I love, love, love this movie. This is an awesome 80s horror film. I love this movie. This is one of my favorite 80s horror films, and this is so cool. And I just recently watched this recently, and I just got, and I absolutely love it. This is a really, if you love 80s rock and roll, metal, ho like horror movies, the effects are great. You'll de you'll definitely love this one if you love that stuff. The effects are great. the The makeup is cool. The gore is great. The storyline is great. Everything about it is great. It's, it has a lot of cool features on here. Um, this is an awesome movie. Definitely check this out. Um, this, and it's pretty much this is about. Um, it's about, it has John Mil Mil Thor and it's directed by John Fasano. J John Fasano. Um, it's pretty much about this group of uh, like rock and roll. Uh, like this rock and roll band are going to this far to this isolated farmhouse and they're they're um recording new music there and when they're there like there's there's, there's like something evil is like stirring up like like something evil's there and like you know it's, it's like possessing them and like you know it's like like all like all this like crazy shit is going on at, at the at the farmhouse and like the at the place that they're going to and it's like like people are like dying, like dying slowly, and people are getting possessed. People are like things are happening. A lot of crazy shit is happening. It's really fun, fun movie, and it's slowly and it's just really epic, really cool effects, really awesome, really amazing movie. Gore is great. Everything about this is great. And this is a this is what a true eighties horror film is about. Like this is what I really enjoy. This is like the type of movies I love to watch. Um, has new new high def new widescreen high high definition transfer transfer from the original th thirty five millimeter camera negative audio commentary by, from director John Fasano and heavy metal icon and star John M Milk Milk Hill Thor um, new Dolby Dolby soundtrack revelations in rock and roll. Warrior, the life and history of John, John McHale featurette, uh, creating a child wolf behind the scenes makeup of featurette, rock and roll shocking me memories, raw footage and shocking sh uh, from the sh set from rock and roll f nightmare, music videos and much more and a lot more and a new new video introduction by John John McHale Thor, the. And and the music I love the music in this I I have the whole soundtrack on my I have the whole soundtrack from this movie it's a really fun movie definitely check this out rock and roll rock and roll baby definitely check this out I love this movie the next one I got is from Sinas Films this is another really cool eighties rock and roll horror film. And by the same director, John Fasano, and that is Black Roses. This is another really cool horror film, 80s rock and roll horror film. I highly recommend you check this one out. This one's a, it's called Black Roses. There's another cover. You probably all seen this cover from the three dimensional face and guitar coming out of the VHS um, cover. Um, it's about this this uh, quiet little town, and they. Um, the people in the town go to this concert every night, and, and they see this rock and roll band called Black Roses, and um, they, they they don't know they don't know much about them. That all, the, but uh, but um, 
that they but they I watch they watch that they're like a big fan of the, of this of this band called Black Roses, and as it's as they and when they watch them like they start like loving them so pretty much like the the, the band is like a uh, a cult is are like like these devil worshippers like not not these devil worshippers these like these uh like they're like they're uh, they they make a pact with the devil and um they're like these like crazy it's hard to explain really what this is about but it's like this uh these this this the band is something's something's strange about the band like something's really weird about the band and these people are turning into these like demonic like turning like turning like crazy every time they watch the band and like turning like obsessed like killing their parents and stuff and like going crazy and stuff it's a really fun movie definitely check this out it's really hard to describe what this is about without giving too much away but i really enjoy this one definitely check this out it's really fun gory fun it cool effects and everything it has some really cool features it has a, a couple of cool features on it um hi has audio has the new anamorphic transfer mastered high def from the original high definition from the hot original camera negative audio commentary from director John Fasano writer Cindy Sorrell f film so so star Carl Fajano and others rare trails audition tapes it's experiments and chapter selections really cool movie definitely check this out um, I'm sorry if I didn't get into a, a really good uh, description about this I just it's really hard to explain but I really enjoy this one definitely check this one out if you love uh, 80s rock and roll horror films and it's it's not as good as rock and roll uh, nightmare but I did enjoy this one as well and I highly recommend you check this one out definitely check this out Next one I got is, um, oh, I got a lot of, st I actually got more stuff than I realized, but I mean, I'm, a but, um, I got, next one I got is from, uh, from, uh, is, is from, I think this is SCS Entertainment, it is, um, a movie called Rattlers 2, um, I don't remember too much about this, it's just a snake, it's a snake movie that, it's a snake, like, attack movie, um, Independent Snake Attack movie. I don't remember too much about this. It has Mel Novak, Brink, Brink Stevens, Mercedes Peterson, and it has um, Sean C. Phillips in it. But uh, it's a, it's pretty decent. It's all right. Um, I didn't remember too. I couldn't remember too much about it, but I really I I remember thinking it was pretty decent. I enjoyed it for what it was, but uh, I I I recommend it. I can, t but it's now out from uh, SR SCS Entertainment. I'll put the link. Where you can get it. Definitely check this out. Next one I got. This one I really enjoyed actually. This is from ITN Entertainment. And that is. Um, Rise, of, Rise of the Mummy. This one was really cool. I enjoyed this one a lot. This one. This one was. Um, this is this is in Walmart. You can get this in Walmart and and a lot of a lot of local and mainly in Walmart you can get this and and online and everything. Um, this is a really cool mummy movie. Really cool effects. Really cool mummy makeup and really creepy, eerie. Um, and and also Sean Sean has a, a a cool cameo in this. And this is just a really cool fun mummy movie. If you like mummy legends and stuff definitely check this one out I highly recommend you check this one out if you can find it um, it's really cool I definitely check this one out and the director is really not his director is really not really cool um, definitely check this one out if you haven't seen it yet last DVD I got then on to the blu-rays is uh 60 seconds to die through is this is from w w m m m and that is 60 seconds to die three um on dvd this is uh an anthology the third the last and the, the final third and final anthology the third and final uh um uh third and final of the trilogy of the 60 seconds to die trilogy this is a really cool uh, this, these are like uh, pretty much shorts, like in horror shorts that are like 60 seconds long. Um, really, there's some really good ones in here. 
and it has Sean and Danny, Sean C. Phillips and Danny have a segment in this with uh, Mark Radtail. Um, a really cool, really cool anthology film. I feel like this, and I, I reviewed the other two as well. Um, really cool if you definitely check this one out. It's from film. It's from um, WWMM Worldwide Worldwide Media Worldwide Me Multimedia. It's a really cool, uh, really cool. Uh, here's the discard. It really cool um, anthology film. Definitely check this out. Now to the Blu-rays. First Blu-ray guy, and this one I'm 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 excited to show because this is a movie that I'm I'm actually in. I I uh, st I I star. I, I I mean I co-star in, and this is a movie called uh, Bloody Nun Two on Blu-ray. Is now available on Blu-ray. Um, this is this is a really 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 cool um, nut uh, uh, horror film. It's it's really funny. Really, I have a really funny character in this named Dewey, and um, it's pretty much about this this like this like uh, this these people are going to this to this brothel, and there's this nun that are kill this nun is killing people at the brothel and stuff, and um, I play the the funny guy. I play one of the funny characters that are like trying to get the women and, and stuff, and it's just really funny. I can't. I don't remember. You know, it's just like it's really cool, really funny. I play a really funny character in this. It's a really cool movie. It has a lot of cool people in it. I highly recommend you check this out. This is from Retro Exploitation Films. It's called Bloody Nun Two. A lot of people didn't really care for this movie, but I enjoyed it for, for what it was. Um, definitely check this one out, and I'll put a link where you can get it. Definitely check this one out. Next one I got, and this one is coming. This one I'm really excited to show, and this is um from, from this is from SRS Cinema, and this and this is um coming. The, the uh, this is the pre-release. It's Camp Murder, and I have a really fun part role in the, a really fun role in this as Cody, um, and this is directed by my buddy Mark Polonia. And this is called, it's called Camp Murder. This is the pre-release from SRS Cinema. Really cool artwork here. And I love, I, it's just, I love the artwork for this. Here's the disc art. And here's the back. I play a character named Cody. I play like the dickish asshole kind of character. And um, this one's pretty much about uh, uh, this, this guy Tommy Heller is locked up in this, in this institution for 20 years. And he finally escapes from... He finally um, he he gets out and escapes and goes on a killing spree at a camp and 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 these teen and and kills these like these he takes like this mask from this from this guy from the, from this from from one of the from one of the campers and then these camp other these other new group of teenagers are going camping in the wood in the woods in the in in, in the woods and camp and camp murder and like smoking partying having fun and then he. Uh, Tom Heller takes the mask and like you know starts killing, starts you know killing them one by one. And I play Cody, one of the campers. It's really fun. It has my buddy, uh, Jet has my buddy Tim Hatch in it, Mark Polonia, Jeff 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 Kirkendall. All, all all my good buddies are in it. Jeff Kirkendall's in it. Pamela Such, it's Jamie Morgan, Matt Bruzio, Matt Bruzio, Bruzio. To, um, and a lot of really cool people and I just definitely check this out everyone did a great job and this, this is one of my favorite favorite Mark Polonia movies I highly recommend you check this one out and their actual release this is this one you can't get anymore um, the actual release is coming out August 10th from, from uh, SRS Cinema there's a different cover coming out I'll mention it I'll be mentioning this a lot this movie but I highly recommend you check this one out this is one of my favorite things I've acted in so far and I it's, I play a really fun role in this. If you want to see a really cool movie of, with me in this, definitely check this one out. I highly recommend you check this one out. And I'll talk about it again when it, when the actual release comes out from SRS Cinema. Next one I got is is uh from uh my, my buddy Sh Clement Shaveler. I think that's how, I think that's how you say it, say it. This is um. This is this is a, a this is a movie that's in, that's in German. It's only in German, but it has English subtitles. And I'll and I'll 
and I'll and I'll put the link to the underneath this video for where you can get this movie. I don't know if you can get it now, but but this is this is this was like a limited release. But it's a Corona Clown. It's a horror. It's a German horror horror film, um, comedy horror film about this clown that get, that it spreads the virus and that, and goes on and people are going camping, and he and like people are getting like sick from this Corona from this Corona from this clown that's cor carrying coronavirus and stuff. It's just really funny, really cool. It's a funny com fun movie. Uh, Sean C. Phillips is in this as well as a as a cameo in lot. And there's some parts in English and some parts in, in most of it's in German, but uh, it's really fun. I highly recommend you check this one out if you haven't seen it yet. Definitely check this one out. Next one I got is um, DC is a DC film from Warner uh, Warner Brothers, and you, and this I know this is a delay. This is very delayed. <laughs> um, it's Birds of Prey, Harley Quinn. I, I, at first I didn't, th I, I did a review with this with Lisa, um, but I, at first I didn't care for this movie, but I actually really enjoyed this one. I actually really enjoyed, uh, th this movie. Um, I actually like this better than, uh, the, uh, Suicide Squad movie, the first one. And there's a new Suicide Squad movie that's coming out that I, I looks really cool, the trailer looks really cool, but Birds of Prey is the one that I really enjoy because I love Harley Quinn, I love Margaret Robbie, she's really great. Um, this is just a really, I love this movie, it's really fun. I, I, this is, I'm not really a big fan of superhero movies in DC and like um, Marvel stuff. But I really enjoyed this one. I highly recommend you see it. You've probably all seen this. This is classic. This is, I mean, not classic. It's not a classic yet. But this is just like a movie you a must see. You gotta see. You know, definitely check this out. Le and last Blu ray I got, last but not least, last Blu ray I got is from Scream Factory, Shout Factory. And that is, um,. This is from the 90s, actually. It's a movie called, with uh, Alicia Silverstone and Carrie Elwells, and that is uh, The Crush. This movie was, this movie kind of disturbed me in ways. Um, this was like really weird, a weird disturbing movie. Um, it's about this guy who, who um, is like a, a, a like a writer, and then she like, he, he like, I forget, I, I don't remember too much about this, because it was, but it's, like this girl was like crush this like the sixteen year old girl was like crushing on this guy on this like you know like this this man and like he and she was like trying to like get it's just really disturbing like she like tries to like it's just like a lot of the weird things happen in this movie like the, like the it's kind of reminds me of like Lolita Lolita or something I think that's how you say it it's like um the the sixteen year old like, I think she was like sixteen thirteen years old. Alicia Silverstone in this, and she was like trying to hit on this, this like this older, older gentleman in this movie, and uh, which is Carrie Elwood's character, and um, she has a crush on him, of course. That's why it's called the crush. So, and he's like a writer or something, or, or I forget he was a writer or something, or I can't remember what he was doing, and he was trying to like back, like back away, tell her to back off and stuff. It's just really strange and disturbing. Um, but I did enjoy it in ways, but it's just, a, uh, and it's her, and he moves into the, like, the neighbor, she's, like, the neighbor and stuff. Just really weird, um, I really well acted, but a lot of it was just, like, ah, uh, cringy. But, um, I, I enjoyed it for what it was, but, eh. If you like, if you like cringy, if you like stuff with, like, I don't know. I don't know what to think about this, <laughs> honestly. Well, those are all the DVDs and Blu-rays I got for the D this DVD update, DVD and Blu-ray update. Thanks a lot for watching and subscribing. Definitely give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed these videos. Leave a comment below. Please rate, subscribe. Be on the lookout for more videos. And I'll uh, see. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks a lot for watching and subscribing. And I'll see you all later. All right. Peace. Yeah.